Good morning guys, welcome back to Rara's Ventures. How are we all today? So, um, how are we? I hope you're well. I'm a bit, I don't know what's wrong with me today. Uh, the storm hasn't quite hit us yet in West Sussex. How about your area? Has it hit you yet? Let us know. So, I have been asking around uh, whether you think my vlog should be in the mornings or in the evenings. Um, and I did a live watch party yesterday and I put the question up again and Hayley was saying, yeah, I think it's a good idea. You can tell us all about your day. And I'm thinking that I might try all this for a week or something, test it, see how it goes, um, see if there's any more people online in the evenings. I'm thinking sort of maybe six o'clock in the evening, give it a go, see what happens. Um, it's all about trial and error, isn't it, I think. Um, yeah, and then I'll tell you about my day and what I've been up to, etc. So I think I'm going to troll that starting tomorrow. So I'll do it Sunday to Sunday, see what it's like. If it's any better, I'll stick to evenings. If it's not, I'm going to play around again and, you know, see what what's what, really, where we go. Um, yesterday's question was, what is the one thing you struggle to be able to do daily and why? Um, we had a comment yesterday from Mandy Duffin. She put, cooking or, prep, or the prep work, should I say, kills my hands and I get really fed up when myself keep dropping things. Um... For your last question, okay, for your last question, I would like to be young and healthy, have a good job and today's payday. Yes, I miss working so much. Um, this is one of the reasons I'm doing this, because I could do it in my own time. Um, if I'm not, if I'm really, really bad, I can either miss it or I can do it in bed type thing. It's less pressure and um, it's not so day to day. I don't know what I'm going to be like. Like yesterday, I was really bubbly. Today, I'm not so bubbly. And little things like that, my pain levels and everything. So, I totally get that. Um, also, yesterday, I said, Did you get anything for Valentine's Day? Um, and Duffin put, I got two bunches of lovely yellow roses, which is my favourite colour. Um, I put, yes, yellow is my favourite colour, it's so uplifting. It is, it's a feel-good colour, isn't it? I think so, anyway, it's brighter. Mind you, the summer is, is a colour that I love. Anyone who knows me knows that. The things I love are yellow, Camper vans and Cornwall. Yeah, that is my big loves type thing. So, yeah, that's that. I didn't, don't think I had any more comments on that. Um, just have a quick look. No, I didn't. But that's all good. It's all good. Um, so today's question is, since becoming ill, what is the best thing you have found that has helped you? So this question can be anything from support groups, on social media or outside social media, it can be equipment that's helped you, it can be um, people to talk to, friends, family, it can be anything, it's not just one thing. So since becoming ill, what is the best thing? you have found that helps you you can say one or two or as many things as you like i mean the things that have helped me is family support 
uh, my mobility scooter to enable me to be self independent and get out and about um, equipment brought into the home to help me so there's quite a few things that have helped me to since being ill to help me be as independent as I possibly can so yeah there's quite a few things that have helped me so let me know what you guys have found that helps you and we'll read them out tomorrow and yeah tomorrow we're going to do it six o'clock sunday okay so remember that uh yesterday i had mum over um and then i had craig's mum over as well and then his brother popped in it it, it went from really quiet to really busy and then really quiet again because they all went out the same sort of time so it was quite a busy day it was really nice um first thing in the morning i popped downtown i did the printing that i needed to do that i was saying about so that's all ready um i'm pretty sure 100 percent we won't be doing tomorrow going to the our location lily said where we're going then don't want to do that yeah, so um, because looking at the forecast, it kind of hits us late afternoon today and carries through to tomorrow. So it's just not worth the risk. Um, with our own illnesses, the driving conditions and everything, it's not worth it. So we're going to postpone it and do it next weekend. Fingers crossed next weekend will be so much better and a lot safer for everyone. Um, so yeah, that's that's our plan of action. So yeah, I'm not sure what we're, we won't be doing a lot tomorrow because of weather. All of you need to try and keep safe in this weather. Oh my God, don't go out if you don't have to. I'm not going anywhere. I've got my scooter right up tight, behind, like beside the house, so it's protected as much as possible. What else can I do? Um, yeah, just watch your backs a bit. Okay, I'm gonna stop a waffling because I'm good at that. Um, so don't forget today's question. Since becoming ill, what is the best thing that have that you have found that helps you? Remember, this can be anything from people to talk to, great social media, products in the home, equipment, anything. It, it doesn't matter. It's just showing people what's helped you that might help them as well. Um, quite important. And remember that I will be coming on tomorrow evening at 6pm to give this a test for... Uh, seven days so it's Sunday to Sunday at 6 p.m. and we'll see how that goes like I said it's trial and error see what works what doesn't okay I hope you guys have a lovely day and stay safe and I'll see you guys tomorrow at 6 p.m. okay guys take care bye